Good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. That's what I said. <laughs> so I guess it's a thing now. <laughs> this is oh my god! I'm out of bounds. <laughs> <clears throat> well, uh, let's just uh, try and fix that, shall we? Like so, and so, I don't know what I've been doing. There we go. Am I too small in this picture? Because I'm really small. Yeah, uh, if you are watching on YouTube and you think I'm too small, uh, comment down below and yell at me and i'll try and fix it <laughs> probably fix it anyway but oh my goodness is there any uh sound capture from the game i don't think so i don't like it uh do this yeah now we have boy, boy. um you be me. way too much Go sound now. I don't know how this happened. <laughs> anyway, today we are uh, visiting the Price family and I chose to go alone with Sydney to school because I can't deal with all the sims that I have. <laughs> so, <laughs> so he is here, here alone and he's just found out from the headmaster that he is in class one. Hang on, I can make the the scale of the controls a little bit bigger so that we can read on the screen like like it's so oh my goodness no stop i don't want the red one there you go let's save i don't think that necessary but that's what i'm gonna do i love that they added that by the way because previously I had to change my resolution to do that. Uh, anyway, so he has a mission here to claim a locker and morning free time ends in one and a half hour. And I guess this is the... Oh, I can assign... Oh, I can switch where he goes to class. Oh, all right. Well... So this is his classroom if I don't change it. Uh, I did change up the, the school. This is not the normal school. Actually, now I don't like the way I sit. <laughs> All right, I'll just move myself this way. No, that's not what I meant to do. There you go. Why am I all blurry now? I don't know. Anyway, you'll have to deal with it. <laughs> I'm kind of tired. I've had a rough couple of days with my depression acting up and everything. Oh, we were changing uh, school classroom. I kind of want to do it on this side uh, today. <laughs> because I've been playing like over here all the time and so I, now I want to be on this side <laughs> so okay so this is now his classroom so we should probably get a locker like this seems to be free I think maybe because it wasn't decorated and you get two lockers I don't know why oh no okay and this headmaster is evil <laughs> <laughs> so, just so you know, he's evil. Not just me that's saying that. Oh, and I have the language uh, mod installed. I, I did see a mod where you can choose your classmates, so you... Maybe, like, it would make sense <clears throat> to choose the ones from the same neighborhood as you, but it's just random right now. So... Wait, so Sydney is 
a native Tartosiano. All right, because I, I said <laughs> it doesn't make sense really, but I assigned Tartosiano as the northern languages. So, and the north is currently, it's Brindleton Bay, uh, Copperdale. Hang on, I have it on file. <laughs> It is Brindle Bay, Copperdale, and Moonwood Mill that I don't have because I haven't bought the pack yet. So it's just those two worlds for now. And I'm not going to buy the pack for a while because I'm busy with this pack. And I don't appreciate them uh, churning out uh, material so much. And then, like, they totally do don't release anything. For so long i i don't i think it's bad pacing <laughs> i just think it's bad uh, i don't know what they're trying to do with that we are decorating now uh i don't know if high school years ship like this or if he got assigned this uh by i don't know mc command center i had it in for a little while it was a mistake don't do it um or if the game did it with with neighborhood stories because I had it set that they could uh, join uh, careers and stuff. So it might be, but now when I loaded him in, he's a cheerleader and he is an overachiever and he's active. So I assume he's gonna be wanna be the top cheerleader. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, oh, we have likes for fashion now wait I do have wonderful whims installed uh, I know that I know that I had that before but I don't know if if it was a mod or not I don't it's still not that's stupid but he likes oh, Pick one color. He likes yellow, brown, green, and purple. What? What? And he dislikes orange. Like like one color, so I know. Um, he likes comedy, mischief, fitness, video gaming. And he likes all the music. Oh my goodness. What is it? Blues, music, hip-hop, pop, and retro. Hip-hop and pop. And blues and retro oh. what are we gonna do well maybe what he likes basics and streetwear um, I don't know what this is gonna do maybe it will work yeah orange there he doesn't like orange uh, but maybe you can see it as yellow. <laughs> uh, I think it can work. He has a guitar at home. Right, now we want to talk to the teacher about the curriculum. Since he's an overachiever, he wasn't goal-oriented when I loaded him in. But I randomized it. I landed on goal-oriented. And since he is a overachiever, I think it makes sense. So we need to find a teacher now. Where is the teacher? Is this the teacher? Clash one teacher. Yes, Rita. Hello, cheerful information. There we go. Rita Coombs. <clears throat> okay. Oh! <laughs> right. I don't know how this happened. Oh, I know how it happened. <laughs> So, in MC Command Center, there is an option to, um, to fill the, the, the world with, with sims that you have saved in your library. Uh, and, and, and it will. <laughs> and I had a family that I used for testing. I just randomized. And they were all named like this, Control 2, Tests on 
obviously. So uh, MC Command Center thought it would be a good idea to put uh, Mr. Testson in here. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, um, if I rename him, <laughs> I might get a new one. So I can't rename him because if I do MC Command Center when I put it back in, it would go, well, there's not a sim named this yet. So... <laughs> I'll just put him in. Um, I think we could kill him and have him dead. <laughs> uh, but that uh, seems like a little bit extreme. So I'll just... Uh, okay. I don't know if this is gonna uh, ruin our entire school day. But I'm gonna try it anyway. And I'm gonna give him some name because this I can't deal with a control to test some running around uncontrolled in my game. His last name is Clevenger and his first name is Farhan. Apparently. I don't know what that means, but that's what I got. Why did Rosita le uh, lose her hair? I do not know. Uh, it doesn't make any sense. You are straight haired, my dear girl. You cannot be having the afro hair. There you go. Yes, I know her since before and she has always had straight hair. Did she have glasses? I don't remember. We could give her eyelashes because we're in here and the game is letting me. Oh dear, no. I think those Will suffice. And see, it only took one of the test humans. <laughs> um. So 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 he he's alone here. Okay, okay. It looked like this. Okay, good. Oh my god, he's also evil and a kleptomaniac. Someone's going in uh, the criminal career. Oh, did I switch to the wrong sim? Sometimes it's like, if it loads in to, to one sim, you need to switch back before you exit, create a sim, or it will switch to that family. I did switch to the wrong sim, didn't I? Um, well, that may as well be. Yep. And this happened. I don't want it. Can I switch to him? Switch control to crit. Yes, thank you. It didn't switch family on me, but it did switch lot to the home lot. I hope it still works. Also, uh, I figured out yesterday that if you switch, if you put the eyelashes on people while they're in their um, winter wear, I don't know if it's anywhere, <laughs> but you know, uh, if you do, then it, it doesn't stick. But if you switch it to their... Uh, What's it called? The regular clothes? The the, the... the sun clothes? You know, this. Everyday. <laughs> That's what it's called. The everyday clothes. So if you switch to the everyday clothes and then put the eyelashes on, then it sticks. Alright, but what are you doing up here? <laughs> You're supposed to talk to the teacher. Where's the teacher? Uh, we walk away now. Here's our classroom, so hopefully she's there preparing our lesson. Okay, uh, we, uh, she's sad apparently. We can console her. Uh, we can... Okay, try and console her. What, what? Talk to them about curriculum. How though? Why isn't it... Like, in front here. I get so upset. 
<laughs> like if I have a mission or a want to do something, what are you so stressed about? Oh, he got stressed from, <laughs> from not knowing the language. She probably speaks like Sim Simlish or something. He doesn't know Simlish at all. We probably, uh, yeah, wait. Sydney speaks Pachosiana fluently, but Rita does not speak it at all. All right, but why wouldn't you speak to the teacher in her language? Okay, well, <laughs> she will have to learn because Copperdale is Tachosiana. So she, did she get, did they get a teacher that doesn't know the language? Like, wouldn't that be a problem? Oh, what happened now? Oh my goodness. <gasps> Sydney Price stopped what we, they were thinking about for a moment and found themselves staring at Lily. Well, isn't that interesting? Because he is with Brenda. But, but he likes Lily and now he's going away. You are an overachiever. You will sit in class when it's class time. You will not go take a nap or whatever. Uh, you're ex attending the exam. Oh my goodness. Okay, will you will you do it? Take exam. Yes. I, I've seen people say that their sim doesn't get their notebook out and do the exam on the exam. This is kind of boring. What are we gonna do? Oh no, what happened now? As you reach the last question on the final exam, an art question emerges. Instead of asking you to name notable works of art, this question asks a more practical art question. It asks about the different painting, different painting techniques and asks you to draw a small sketch to demonstrate your expertise. Well, I don't know if he has any painting skill, but it seems like you should rely on what skill you have and if you don't have it well that's how you get graded i guess sydney trusted in his understanding of the subject matter and felt it gave a pretty good answer to the question large skill based exam boost okay well uh did what <laughs> what happened he doesn't have almost skill even skill based exam Boost. Large, <laughs> large skill based exam boost. Uh, do they even have a drawing skill in the game? Do we have one? I don't, I don't know. Well, what's happening on the social bunny? I am doing an, a, an exam, so I need to check my social bunny. That will be allowed, probably. Uh, Kevin is being indecipherable and we have uh, notifications about messages that we don't have. Uh, <laughs> we can do a post about orientation and he is, um, he is energized about that because he wants to become energized. And uh, why is it like this? If I send someone a message... Well, does he want to break up with Brenda now? Oh no, he will be heartbroken. Well, uh, let's let's just send a friendly message to Kevin, and then, do we even know Lily? Can we add her? No, we cannot add her. Well, we can add this boy. <laughs> let's add some friends. Uh, we don't add our parents. I'm thinking also about uh, totally disabling social bunny once a sim gets to adulthood because it's annoying. Um, I can't leave it be. Do we add our sister? Like, sure, why not? And that's our own post. <laughs> don't. don't um we could 
send a funny message to Savannah about not being in school. There you go. No, I mm, see. Now we have the ploop. I don't like the ploop. There's nothing new. Just the ploop. You need to switch tabs before you close it, or you still have the ploop. I hate the ploop. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. This little thingy here. The calendar is always excited. <laughs> like, about everything. Oh, there's a cheerleading team of sports day thing. Okay. All right. Okay, I, I can deal with that right now. Let's just have it happen when it happens. Also, this uh, Daniela is missing hair. Yeah, you're sad about that, are you? Well, maybe she has cancer. I don't know. I can't be fixing everyone's hair. It's impossible. I took my CC out, so now half the town is without hair. Anyway, <laughs> we have a lunchtime, um, and we want to be friendly with a faculty member. Is is this a faculty member? We could ask her about her day. If we don't want to do that but do we get any credits for doing these things i don't know but now we have done this and we will be friendly with this student that we think is uh very pretty apparently stop talking to the teacher yes okay everyone is going now where did she go oh my goodness no we don't know her we can't lock on her okay there you are See, she is taking something from her locker, an apple. Maybe we should do that too. After we talk to her. If if it's good enough for Lily, it's good enough for us. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, she came in here, okay. I tried to stop talking to the teacher, but I was unsuccessful. Okay, now we know her. Now we can add her to our social bunny and she will be uh, social bunnied. Add to contact list. Lily, there we go. Uh, new post. Uh, we thought... Oh my... Did it go well? Yes, it did. Okay. And we want to tag a sim. No, we can't do it publicly because we we got Brenda. We got to do something about that. Let's just do a friendly message publicly to Lily. <clears throat> I'm sorry about my voice. I don't control it <coughs> apparently. Um, and then we can send Lily a flirty message. And can you ask like, what does this mean? <laughs> up? Where? Wh what do you mean up? Of course he's not sleeping, so it can't mean that. I don't know. Oh my god, he's stressed about the test because he wasn't prepared for forgetting daily task. How could Sydney sleep up like this? First, it's just simple task. Second, the m he might end up failing at important things like his occupation or skills. Oh no. Well, let's leave this conversation so that we can uh, start a new conversation with just Lily in a little bit when she... Where did my apple go? I, I said to go grab an apple. When she's not talking to the teacher anymore, we can talk to her without the teacher because it's... Uh, um, like, can you come over? Uh, uh, call over. We can ask her about languages. Um, now she's talking to the teacher. I don't like it. Where do you have your apple? Oh dear. Oh well. There it is. <laughs> I'm very concerned about the apples. There we go. Okay. I speak Salvadoradian fluently and Simlish very well. Oh well, we speak Tartosian, so uh, that that's a problem. Uh, where are you even from? I can't remember where I put her. Salvadorada? If she speaks Salvadoradian fluently, she is either from Oasis Springs, Strangerville, or Salvadorada, but I took the residential Salvadorada out because it didn't work very well, so... 
But I attached the deserts to Selva Dorada uh, in my game, um, and and I renamed it to Faraway Land <laughs> because what I had it named as wasn't accurate at all. But I need to to group my my worlds. So she is from far away, <laughs> and uh, and he likes her. All right. Uh, the lunch will end. I wonder what happens in the cafeteria. I guess it's a good idea not to go there immediately. My goodness, stop chatting with the teacher. Why are you chatting with the teacher? He's not going to give you get better grades because you do that, I think. I really wonder if she is like a generated sim or if I had her in my game already. Go. See, I always have this issue. I press for them to eat, but then they don't. Especially here. I think what happens is like they see something, <laughs> they want to eat it, but then it, it could be this, but that belongs to Lily. So she picks it up and we lose the action. So I don't know whose hamburgers he's about to eat. Not a vegetarian, is it? See, see now he's stopped. What is, what is going on now? Well, she might have a fear for something, I don't know. See, now he, he tries to take her uh, Thing. I want I want him to order food, so I don't want to like pick for him. <laughs> I want to see what he orders, but apparently every sim just want to glitch around and steal people's food. Can you order something, please? Please. No, he can't. Okay. No, because the cafeteria lady stopped serving. Did you... Like, let's say hi to her. I don't know. Turinga. There, can you serve me food, please? No, he can't. She can't. Okay, we'll we'll we had an apple. We'll eat these veggie sliders that belongs to someone else. <laughs> oh, we'll have the leftovers. What are you doing with your hand there, buddy? Okay. Well, at least you're sitting in the chair, or on the chair, I don't know. Yeah, okay. Does it smell okay? Yes. This is a single bed, apparently, and it's assigned to the Sydney. Everything is so weird. Well, don't you just hate it when the principal does that? Because it's kind of scary. Why are you wearing that? No, now he's a custodian. <sighs> Aren't you the principal? I can't. What is happening? I was pretty sure. No, Krishna? Krishna is the pr principal. He's a custodian. Okay, well, it's not less scary when he does it. Oh dear. Um, um, um. Should we ask her to prom? It's Friday. It's prom tomorrow. Wait, I do have... Um, wait. Yes. No aging on. <laughs> Sometimes I get scared that I have aging on when... Things... <laughs> yes, okay. We can ask her for prom tips. Maybe that will work. Okay, the custodian is gone again. Now over there, he must be a vampire, I think. What did what did you do to the chair, Lily? What happened? Oh my God! The prom is coming. The dance takes place on Saturday evening at Copperdale, Copperdale High School Auditorium. Dinner will be served. Uh, yes. Okay. Ask someone to prom. Prepare your formal outfit. Okay, we'll do that later. Are you studying? Can I study too? I can do homework, I guess. Well, it's time to go to class. Don't do that. Uh, okay, well, I think we made a fairly good first impression on Lily. 
think. Oh, also I decided um, all teens will necessarily have the teen aspiration, one of the four. Because that's uh, how I'm gonna play now. <laughs> so all the teens that I play will have one of those. Then I will not give them a personality from the personality mod until they're adults when I can assess all of their traits. So. Okay. Another exam. Oh, no, no wonder he's not prepared. I just switched to this family. Uh, I was playing the university family and I was so sick and tired of them. And all of them had like either graduated or went on probation or been suspended. So I thought, well, <laughs> let's just go somewhere else and do uh, something else until the next sim week when I'm gonna play the Flynn family again. And I will not play them. I tried. <laughs> I tried, I, I thought, oh, let's just play them with aging off until uh, until Monday and then turn their aging on and they have two babies and two toddlers. I, no. <laughs> I will not play them for extra time. <laughs> I say they, it's just one mom with all the kids. All crazy. Oh, what is happening? Oh, did he? He's left. You're taking an exam, but you're making. What? How? What is even happening? Are you still taking the exam? I don't think you are. I don't know. Are you done? Okay. The school day will end now. What will happen? Okay, it's the weekend. Jaden wraps up his week with a C in school. Is that really satisfactory? Jaden, okay. Uh, okay, Kevin didn't do so well. And Savannah should have prepared. Okay. What about Sydney? <laughs> Did he get, Sydney get no results? So he, he thought he would work out instead, I guess. Okay, what happened now? Is there an event going on? No. What is happening? Okay, come on. So, the cheerleading team starts at 5, he's very tired, and he doesn't have any of this, so maybe we should focus on having a nap. No use going home when you're going to be back here in two hours, you just have a nap on this very comfortable bench. Sydney is an overachiever. Overachiever sims gain skill faster and enjoy raising their skill or finish for work faster to get ahead. Well, that's uh, kind of shitty, I think. I don't, sometimes <laughs> I think they make the game. They gave us the challenge and they like, here's a challenge. Here's how we made it easy. <laughs> and I was like, then it's not a challenge. Then it's like, but it's still like a um you get an archetype and if the sim is an overachiever then it's automatically overachieving i guess so it's fine i don't know he wants to make it do his homework five times well then you... is he even gaining any energy from this now the principal probably will yell at him for being a human i don't know He's not gaining any energy. I don't know. I don't know. He's not losing energy, I guess. Where is the football field? I was looking around here earlier and I thought like, hey, look at this. Here's like some stuff. What if we can like go here and do something? And then I found this little shed and I thought, oh, look, th this is a missed opportunity. What if this shed was actually a shed and you can actually go inside? It doesn't have to be anything in there. <laughs> you can just, like, 
That would have been so cool. They could fall around in here. That maybe you put like a sofa or something, and they could just make out. Um, but you can't even stand out here to take pictures and pretend you go inside. You can't even like go behind. Look, look at this. You could go behind here and sell drugs. No, you can't because you can't go here. Because because apparently this ground is like not available. But if you go here. Oh, like just over there there you can stand there it's fine but wouldn't you want to go behind here like the cool kids probably go behind here and go like uh don't want to be in our motorcycle gang <laughs> i don't know <laughs> maybe not the cool kids the bad kids i don't know i want to go behind stuff okay I was listening to the the founder of the Earth 2 nonsense and he he was like I always wanted to go uh, where you couldn't go and and I was like yeah if you're going to have a game where you can go where you can't go you better make sure it looks like you can't go there so that it feels like you go where you're not supposed to but this blocking blocking to go here is just stupid. I don't know because otherwise, okay. Well, let's let's try and jog here and see if that works. I don't know if it, if it will work. I have been trouble. Oh see, see, I have been having routing issues uh, a lot. So jog there then. I guess if you can yes you can so if I if I ask them to go like from front where they spawn to here then they know, don't know how to do that I don't know if the it, it's a this is a custom build that I downloaded from the gallery I don't know if there's something wrong with it but it doesn't seem like what could possibly be wrong with it <laughs> I don't understand it, but Sims get confused. Now he's out there, so let's have him try and y'all over there and see if he can figure that out. Yes, he could. Congratulations. Um, because I had one Sim like she was over there, I think, and she couldn't figure out how to get over here because of the bushes. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, hello, I can't go there. It's very weird. Okay, there's one other kid here. It's Caden Harris. Hello. The the main Baranga. main thing I like about high school thingy, this this high school thing, is that you get to take your teenagers here and the game just spawns all the teenagers here. <laughs> Not all of them, but you know, a lot of them. And you get to know a bunch of teenagers. Julie. So that's nice. Okay, so is there or is there not a cheerleading team sports day from 5 p.m. today? Because it's 6 p.m. So can we like... What is happening? Oh, also, I had to take pre-teams out, <sighs> sadly. Uh, I was wondering what it would be like anyway to have pre-teams in high school. It would be weird, I guess. What is going on? Is, is it a festival for ghosts? Are there only invisible ghosts here that they're doing something? I don't know what it is. Like, where, what, what is happening? I don't know. <laughs> is it over? I don't understand. Did I miss it? No, it's going over to 10 p.m. All right. Well, let's just talk to this dude then. Wait, is he straight or not? I don't know. But he's at least. Wait. <laughs> Wait, I don't know this. Because he was attracted to Lily. Where is Lily? 
He's over there. Why? <laughs> what is happening? Um I need I don't think do, do these sims come with sexual orientation? I don't think they do. No, this is the standard thing. But we do know he is attracted to women because of what has been happening. So we need to know if it's like a... Uh, what did I say? It was like a 70... 70% chance that they are straight, so since we, we know he's not asexual and he's not or like not aromantic and he's not uh, gay, then we can know that he is uh, So I got What did I just do? Okay, so, yeah, so it's a 70-10% chance that he is straight. <laughs> and, and if, no, wait, oh! Yeah, so we got 71, so that means he's actually bi. Alright, okay. He likes men too. <laughs> I'm getting it now. Alright, so, is this sim exploring romantically? What did I say about that? I had rules. Did I... Did I uh, note them down somewhere? I think I did on Wani.essia on my little website, challenge rule. Let's see. Okay. Yes, yeah, 70% chance that he is, that they are straight. And then it's 50-50 if they are exploring romantically. So let's see, we get a two and then that means yes. And then what's it for the other one? Interested in woohoo. 80% chance they are interested in woohoo with the genders that they are romantically attracted to. All right, so we do it for, since he likes both, we do it for both. And so one through hundred and see if we get what did I say eighty. Uh if if we get one through eighty, then he is interested in having woohoo with men. Uh yes he is. And then <clears throat> for women he is not. I got an eight ninety-eight. <laughs> Alright. Okay, well that's Certainly interesting. Hmm. Yes, <laughs> this this is. I don't know what how to say that, but this is what happened, and I will have to adjust my brain now. <laughs> oh, um. I I think this might mean What does it mean if he's already interested in both men and women and then he's also exploring romantically? What does that mean? I don't know. But I I think it it's going to mean that he's probably will be ending up with a guy in the end, but right now he seems uh, to focus on the women for some reason. Maybe he's afraid about what other people would think. Um, and uh, no. Maybe we do some. Like, is Brenda here? <clears throat> Brenda is not here. Good. <laughs> Can we even find Lily? Is, is she too far away? I don't know. Yeah, he couldn't find her. <laughs> He's way over there and he doesn't know how to go to her. Oh my goodness. Why doesn't she come to... Where are you going? Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, what are you doing now? 
Do do a, I want to see this? <laughs> do a shit. Why are you facing that way? Shouldn't they be facing the other way? I don't get this. I did not edit this at all, so it's not my fault. Maybe she, yeah, Lily went home. Wait, I need to, um, I need to put in my spreadsheet. Do I have, no, I don't have. I'll just put a note in it in my regular. Where is he? Sydney. Oh, I don't even have him in here. Why not? What? Didn't I add them? I'm pretty sure I did. Price. Where's the price family? There you go. I can't spell, that's why. Okay. Uh, here is... We can just... Note that he's a cheerleader. And he's... Uh, bye. And I'll, I'll add it to a better spreadsheet later. Yeah, that, I, I, I kind of like my randomization there. It, it gave this character <laughs> uh, some depth that I didn't think about. Who are you? Oh, Sakura. I thought it was Jenna Akiyama, and I was like, uh, she's not a teen, but Sakura is, so... <laughs> In my game. She flew, she flurps, yes. Okay. So let's have him talk to everybody. Competition judge. Okay. And we could no don't invite her. She'll spawn way over there. I can't deal. <laughs> She's not here. She it can oh my goodness, broken CC. I didn't even know what what I didn't put in much CC. So the little I put in apparently is broken. That's too bad. Uh-huh. Who are you? Hans Steinberg. Oh. Well, he's the. Wait, I think. Oh, yeah, he's the half brother of his girlfriend. Are they girlfriend and boyfriend? Uh, maybe we should like go over to Brenda's house. And I don't know. Break up with her? No. Maybe he's. Wait, wait. We can check. Is he? She is perceived as a. Uh, attractive. What is this? Do we know that she is exploring romantically? Oh! Is this a mod? <laughs> is this Wonderful Whims? Or is it is it base game? I don't even know. Okay, and then if we... Wait, was she attractive or very attractive? Attractive. Alright, okay. And then Lily is very attractive so we would rather be with lily right now at least so oh and he's freezing to death oh that's too bad <laughs> oh the social bunny i've been thinking about maybe i should like only do social bunny like like when they wake up and when they Get home or something. I don't know, and not no other types <laughs> because I keep doing it all the time, and it, it gets. I don't know. Oh, he does not like this teen, Noah Kane. Oh, I thought his name was Dragon. It is Dragon. Okay, Dragon broke. Okay. Well, that's an interesting name choice. Alright. You're very pretty. Yes. Hello.
is attractive. <laughs> it's very attractive. That's what I thought. I don't know why I thought that. But I just did. Oh my goodness. Suddenly everyone is very attractive. Oh, not her. What about Noah? Uh, he's okay. What about Caden? I need to... Don't you wish you had the... He's his sister. <laughs> Don't you wish you had the bolt system that was so it can shake like faster? Very attractive. Alright, okay. Well, uh, he's getting tired, so I'm gonna have him go. Nothing's happening here. I don't understand these festivals. Um, he's gonna go visit Brenda because she wasn't at the festival and he is kind of upset with her about it. And also, uh, Lily is so much more pretty, so uh, he's not taking anyone there. <laughs> so that's... Uh, he, he's gonna go break her heart a little bit. I don't know, maybe at least fight. See what happens. He's an overachiever, but I don't think that would mean that he would try to achieve multiple girlfriends or be unfaithful, so I think like he would... He found Lily attractive, so he's gonna be a... Uh, uh, ending it with Brenda so he can go with Lily to the prom and hopefully oh maybe sh maybe you should ask Lily first well or maybe he doesn't care maybe he he has, doesn't want to go to prom with Brenda but he if he can't have Lily uh, Lily to prom then I don't I don't know why her name is in caps uh, <laughs> then so be it. Here she is. Okay, let's. Um, okay, shout forbidden words to her because that's what we want to do. All of a sudden, what is what is happening here? From showing a popularity aspiration, so you get both relatable and gregarious. Oh, okay. Yo, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, uh, well, I'm kind of tired, but I am uh, uh, trying to figure out Sydney Price today. I was looking at the entire family, I would think, but I just started with Sydney and I'm busy with him. <laughs> so we have figured out that he is bi and he is interested in woohoo with only men, not women. <laughs> My randomizer said so. It's not my fault. Uh, and I don't know what would be wrong with that, but he has a girlfriend, so that's the problem. And he got a notification that he thought that Lily here was really cute, um, but he is with Brenda, so now he, uh, he wants to do something about that. Oh my goodness, what is this? Is it a cat? I don't even know. <laughs> anyway, where did she go? Where is she? She she went away. Uh, look camera. Oh, what? What is happening? What are, what are you doing? This game, I don't understand it. <laughs> All right, and in my absence. Uh, okay, so uh, Brenda is actually uh, from Brenda Tompe, and she was living with the Flynn family because uh, she was the daughter of the Flynn family, but um, she couldn't study, she felt, because there were babies all over the place and toddlers and stuff, and her mothers couldn't stop uh, getting more babies. <laughs> <laughs> so she said, I'm gonna be an exchange student, I'm gonna go live here with the Villarreal family and or like the old couple um, and so uh, here she is <laughs> and uh, let's insult her face because um, she's only attractive, not very attractive like Lily. So as uh, what Sydney felt I was right to do. 
Um, okay. You don't have to... Oh my goodness. He doesn't have to be so mean about it. Or maybe he's like... Um, hmm. I mean, he could just break up with her. <laughs> but no. <laughs> he did not. He started saying awful things. I, I need to take pictures of this. Why does he look so much smaller than her? Doesn't make any sense. Okay. Ah! Uh, don't do a small apology. Like, okay, are we? Are we not? Are we not boyfriend and girlfriend? Is that? How are you already prom dates? Oh, that happened in my absence too. Wait, they went to the last prom together. Does that mean that they will always go to prom? I don't like it. But they're... Okay, so she's actually not his girlfriend. Can we, like, say we will not... Uninvite to prom. I will not go with you. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness. I, I cancelled it. Because I'm silly. Uninvite. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no! I feel so bad for her! Oh no! Well, maybe that was why he was mean, because she would, like, now she can think, but well, he's a mean boy. I don't want to go with him. Uh, otherwise, Sydney is no longer going to prom with Brenda. And. Does he need to pee? Yes, he's very tired, so he doesn't have the energy to go uh, have some kind of date thingy with Lily, so... I don't know what to do about that. Maybe we send her some flirting messages on Social Bunny. There, and we could tag a sim. Be mean, <laughs> Be mean to Brenda so that everyone knows. That we are mean. <laughs> mean. Oh my goodness. We did not prepare for prom yet, though. Uh, let's be stressed about that. And then, what is happening? Your follower account and you are the same. A big zero. Okay, but maybe we uh, do that. <laughs> I don't know. And let's send a flirty message and then do a tag her. See, this is what happens. I, I, I can never stop. There. Okay, okay, okay. Did I do everything? See? <laughs> so I never get anywhere. Let's just go home. That, but it worked. We we now have some uh, romance with with Lily. I don't even read the messages anymore, except for like finding out if their other messages are being mean to me. But the ones I post, I don't read them anymore. Oh my goodness! Too far to walk. And I know you can just press the M button, but um, travel costs. <laughs> Sometimes I press the M button. I press the M button to go away, but to go home, I always press just go home. I don't know. Sometimes I press M because I want to bring someone. Oh well. No, don't drink coffee. It's in the middle of the night and you're tired. So go to bed. Come on. So I figured I hate it when like they have this assigned bed uh functionality. But when you load a lot, 
the beds are not assigned. So you don't know what they were thinking, but I'm guessing this is Savannah's bedroom and I'm guessing this is Kevin's bedroom because like he has his own little part of the house here because he's an ex exchange student. I don't know what to do with him once he graduates. Uh, I guess he just moves out, I think. Um, and I guess this bedroom is very boring, so it's obviously the parents' bedroom, I guess. So that leaves. <laughs> oh, also, uh, this it was a kid's, this is a kid's bedroom. <sighs> what is it with this desk under this bed? It's not allowed, apparently. Oops. Apparently, uh, it just flips whatever you put in here into the inventory. What is this? Okay. Well, and I don't like it. Why? Why? Why does that keep happening? I should report that bug because I saw someone else have it too. So it's probably all right. He didn't know go to bed. Why? They're obsessed with coffee, I tell you. Is there a mod that makes them like where you could set what times they would take coffee? Because I think it would be reasonable if they're tired like from uh, 7 a.m. to like th 3 oh, from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. or something like that. Then they would drink coffee, but after that, if they're tired, they just have a nap. And if it's like after 8 at night and they're tired, they go to sleep. Like, <laughs> is there a mod to do that? Because it, the, the way they go for coffee in the middle of the night, it doesn't make sense. So, okay, let's, he went to bed, so let's have a look at Savannah over here. She is different. She is a geek. She is materialistic. And she's a computer whiz. Okay. Well, I'm gonna put her in the teen. I'm gonna remember that. Uh, I can write it in my spreadsheet. Uh, Savannah. Computer quiz, because, but she is a geek, so so it makes sense, anyways. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna randomize <laughs> random.org. Like, I can't live without it when I'm playing. Okay, so I got a one, so she's a drama llama. What? <laughs> well, what else would she be? Okay, she's a drama llama. I don't know. You could be a drama llama. Oh, let me tell you. I went to school uh, com uh, for university, computer science, and I've never, I have never, even before or after, had so much drama going on. Like the computer geeks, they, they're, there's drama. <laughs> there, there was so much drama <laughs> and I was the center of it no I wasn't but there was a lot um, okay and naturally she's a computer team fresh recruit and she wants to does she want to do this I don't know she wants to buy an object from being materialistic and she wants to listen to electronica uh, music. Well, what object could we possibly get her? Well, she wants to listen to music. What if I exchange this for something else? Wait, did she like some sort of decor or something? She... Uh, 
she likes all the colors apparently pink and white and black and blue all right not green oh my goodness and she does not have a decor preference all right well that makes it easier i guess This is not in order. So let's filter. Oh, I made this, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> and then I lost it, but I found it on my Tumblr, so I, I got it again. Um, she liked, what was it, pink and white and black and blue? Was it like this? Right, so we could pick any of these to go in a room I kind of like this <laughs> it's kind of weird though I have a plan don't worry uh, oh this is cute let's put that there and then go to electronics hello come on electronics and let's do you know what's silly where is it where's the speaker thing i wanted a new speaker isn't it a sp isn't it shouldn't it be here is it in here oh it's because i have okay the filtering man there I had to make this a custom content because of the stupidness <laughs> so it wasn't showing up in my game but if I could go into uh, Sims 4 studio and extract it and make it a package so I did um, but it, very weird way of giving your fans uh, a reward, <laughs> I would say. Anyway, um, decorations. So I want some clutter. What is this? Unorganized documents. I don't think she would have that. You have some shoes. No. Some old photos, maybe. Oh, it's too big. I don't want, I don't like it. Wait, if I go, no. But if I go to kids room and click this button, will I get more appropriate? Oh, I get condoms. Fantastic. <laughs> um, well, let, let's do this thing. Woof, girls, nibbles, comes. They don't even have a dog. Why is it so hard to find some stuff? Uh. Is that not good? just want it to be like behind the speaker so that it looks yeah not so empty <laughs> okay there we go so i bought you an object worth 500 all right okay <sighs> let's have you listen to electronic music Admire the new possession. Yes, do that. Be happy about me buying stuff. Listen to... Are these suddenly in alphabetical order? Because that helps. Like a lot. Why is it so laggy all of a sudden? What is going on? 
I haven't had lag in my game, like at all. And then I put in some new mods yesterday. Maybe it's the wicked. No, it's not wicked. It's wonderful. <laughs> Maybe it's the wonderful winds. I don't know. Because uh, what it does is it checks, like for each sims, it checks around for each other sim, so it could take a while for the game to process. So I think that could be the culprit sometimes. He also he has a lot. Oh my goodness! <gasps> Attractive sim! Who? Savannah stopped what they were thinking about for a moment and found themselves staring at Kevin! Oh my goodness. So... <laughs> Alright, and I didn't ra uh, randomize her yet. Oh my goodness. Uh, well... Extremely attractive. I should have uh, uh, randomized everyone. Right from the start. But I didn't. So let's let's see. Yes, this this is the standard way. I always get confused. I'm like, she's not attracted to anyone. Um let's just have her we don't we don't know so let's do wait so here's the rules okay uh randomize one to 100 and see what happens um we get an 86 damn i'm getting a lot of high numbers 86 so she's attracted to both the enters okay and then it's 50-50 if she's exploring or not. Get a three, shows so she is. And then I just unclick them to know what I've been doing. So it's 80% uh, chance that she is interested in Woohoo there. Yes. Uh, and yes. <laughs> okay. So, well, she is very bi. <laughs> Okay, all right. Um, so let's add it here. Where's the comment section? Savannah. She could be like, she is so bi. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna put gay uh, in a, in parenthesis for uh, for Sydney because like he is he is sort of bi but not really <laughs> I don't I don't know I'm gonna assume the parents are straight, or at least by, I don't know. I saw a post that someone said like, uh, so everyone has like two parents in their families. And in this family, yeah, there is. <laughs> I got a present that I think is dumb. I want to trade it with a friend or give it back. Can I do that? We only have one choice, so and we. I hate that we don't know who's advising, like when we choose, because uh, that that information would influence my decision. Marcel has advised Jaden affecting his character values. Okay, so it was Marcel, and here is not wanting a child right now. <laughs> so oh. Uh, we should send him to get condoms then, I think. Wait. Uh, go, go by. What about Janae? She does also not want children, so she can also go buy uh, condoms. 
Uh, go buy woohoo protection okay. items. Uh, I don't think. See, these are like they just turn teens, so they're like in my game. I think I I set it to they start teenage years at like twelve or something, maybe even eleven. I don't know. Um, not. It works like this. Okay. So here, here it's how it works. <laughs> so I said how many days each age group has according to some information I found on the internet. And then I said, okay, uh, do one sim day is, is that like a uh, half a year? Then it means that elder ends at 66, which is Kind of young, but it's the Sims, and if I like, I could do like this, and they get to go to a hundred. But then teenage years doesn't start until sixteen, which is actually possible. I don't, I guess because otherwise, if I have it, I can never decide how I do this. If I have it like this uh, then they start being teens at 11 and I had a preteen set so that they would be preteens until they were 16 which made sense but then I had to take it out because school wasn't working even when they were not preteens so maybe I should have it like this this is why I made all of these numbers <laughs> <laughs> a um a function of uh, of this cell now I'm rethinking the whole spreadsheet because i have i i set how old they are on Mondays, but maybe I should instead set how many days they have lived but it, it makes sense I don't know. This does not make any sense to change it right now, though. So we will just have to like have it 0 0.5 um, at least until I have completed round. We are on round six now, and some of them are uh, have finished round six. So where's my column? Here's my rotation column. So these are already in rotation 7 so it wouldn't be fair to them <laughs> to change the the age right now it would it would be weird i don't <laughs> but i'm i'm constantly trying to rethink everything so ah. who knows uh also if you don't like spreadsheets that, that's too bad what is this oh she likes the played music, okay. I can't hear the music though. That's weird. Change volume. Huh. Oh, we could put. I forgot we could change the volume. Volume. So then the teenagers can like disturb the rest of the family, but see, they're not disturbed. But we could pretend. <clears throat> Okay, but talk to him then if you think he's so sexy. Do a sexy pose. Hello. Maybe this is meant to be. But she will have to fight for uh, him with her brother at some point, I guess. Because he also finds him very attractive. All right, what is the kid doing up at 2 a.m. actually? Go to bed. See, now that the... Share the, mm, is gone again. Why does it keep happening? Is it because I have move objects on? I don't know. Oh, also, this is supposed to be here. <laughs> I put this like this. I was very specific about it. 
<clears throat> I had this happen in another house and it was exactly this desk in exactly this color. Um, two. <gasps> what is oh, woohoo protection items were added to Marcel's inventory. They do use it autonomously, don't they? I think. Oh, Ooh, there's settings. I've never seen this before. <laughs> this is the Woohoo Wellness mod by Lumpinu, I think. Um, what is this? The system pop-ups are choice moments related to this mod, which are shown when a sim asks some things to another. Would like to adopt... Uh, oh, right. And we could have... Off... Oh. If off, sims will see the sessions pop up by default and you can manually disable them. On a s what? If on, the session pop ups will be turned off. Dear mod creator, you're being confusing. <laughs> what? If on, it's off and just walk away. I don't if on, decision pop-ups will be turned off. Oh, it's the no decision pop-ups. <laughs> you can then enable them. All right. Okay. Well. Yes. Modify setting. Okay. I think I want it like this because I want... I don't want to be in control. <laughs> <clears throat> no throw up in on toilet if no morning sickness if on sims will not see the option to throw up when they don't know that they're pregnant and aren't waking up with morning sickness uh yes okay this is a lot of settings i i was just interested in like will they use the condoms automatically um that's all I wanted to do how to add unborn babies to family. Oh my goodness. I will have to go through that later. I think that was a new update. <laughs> I don't I don't know if they will use wait. Is there something? No, this is not it. No. More cells? No. Oh, no. Okay. You can get a sterilization surgery. Um. No. <laughs> Not right now. They have the condoms. When she... Hmm. I don't know. Well, uh, let's try it. <laughs> uh, um, I don't. I would like there not to be one like that. Well, well. <clears throat> there's probably a setting somewhere that I missed. Just do the woohoo. <clears throat> Oh, and then we can check if um, well, they're they're full on energy because I just loaded this family and then everything is out of whack. Mm. What is happening up, up here? Uh, nothing. Okay. Two a.m. Ooh, a pillow fight with Kevin. Oh, she has a bonnet. I don't know when to use those. 
But I guess she has one. All right. Okay. Well, I should have checked how many condoms they had before. They both have eight. They can't possibly use one from each. Where's the setting? I don't know. I like that they sit on the bed and pillow fight because uh, in earlier Sims games they just like pulled the pillow out of the back pocket and had a pillow fight. It didn't really make sense. <laughs> Oh, he did use a condom because... Oh, they both used one, one each. I'm very safe. <laughs> okay, and then they didn't go to sleep after because they're not tired. Okay, all right. Well... Uh, Savannah, is this your wardrobe? Ah. Is it? Why is it so hard to click it? There are books. Wait. Isn't this a wardrobe? It should be. Now I need another one. Oh my goodness. Who has one? Okay. You know what? Let's let's have Sydney plan outfits for both of them. For prom. And see what they will be wearing. Maybe they already have good formal outfits, I don't know. Alright. What did I do? <laughs> that with him, I guess. Oh. He has a lot of options here. They fell in love pretty fast. Didn't I tell the kid to go to sleep? I tried to. He decided to stay up. Hey kid, why why aren't you going to sleep? Oh, you can't go there? What is happening? Couldn't you at least tell me that it's hard for you to go there? What's wrong with this? Let's have a little uh, look-see. Now move objects is off. And that means you can't put this bed here because of the curtain, I guess. Let's remove the curtain. Maybe that's the issue all along. Didn't help at all. Hmm. If I move this over somewhere, like around here, will it be better? Oh, into other object. Is it this lamp that is the problem? Maybe. Yeah, okay. But if I remove the lamp, put this here, will I have no issues anymore? Let's just remove the lamp completely because it was just silly, I guess. Let's see if that is going to solve it. I don't know. Can you now go to sleep? <clears throat> Are you able to? Yes. All right. Why did you move it out into the hallway? I don't know. What is the significance of relax? I don't know. What does he want out of life? I didn't... Hmm, I didn't randomize him. Maybe we should have... Let him have a say. <laughs> in his gender preferences? Maybe? I don't know. Is it... Is it important? We don't know. So he... He already has... This changed a bit. So this means that I will not change it and he is a straight, so uh, Sydney is out of luck. Right, okay. 
Great. I wish we could check that without going into creator sim because annoying. So, what have you been up to? I was going to tell you it was Saturday, but you probably know that already. Uh, anyway. They do have wants. He wants to ask Marcel about his day. Oh my goodness. Could you do that? No. No, it's too hard. Let's have a deep conversation instead. Uh, friendly. Why don't you do things when I tell you to do things? It's so annoying. <laughs> Gonna have coffee, okay. Do they ever get wants to uh, to do their homework? I don't know, but he wants to do his homework five times. Like his aspiration is to do that. But I sometimes feel like even if you aspire to do your homework, maybe if you only want to watch TV, <laughs> then you, you don't do, you don't get your aspiration done? I don't know. Can't you drink coffee and do the homework at the same time? No, apparently not. She wants to gossip five times. Okay, can we gossip to him? How do we do? Gossip, gossip. Why isn't it at the start since she has the aspiration to? Why is it like this? How do I even gossip? I don't know. Gossip. Yeah, like, I don't think that's good gameplay. Looking for an interaction in the in a pie menu. Like, it doesn't... It's not like it's it's a challenge, but it's not a fun challenge. It's just I don't know. Do these people have jobs? Yes, they do. All right. Do they have fears? No, they don't. Okay. She wants to level up handiness skill. From what? From being clumsy. <laughs> okay. And she wants to skill up. Okay. Well, apparently now she's cooking food. She, he wants to read something. Okay. Then do that. Enthuse about new show. Why do they only... I'm gonna have her program instead. <laughs> I don't... Okay, uh... Should she hack something or mod a game? Well, it's... She's meant realistic, so, um... If she can get some money from hacking, I think she would do it. I think. <laughs> Mess around in the cuddle cart. What's a cuddle cart? Travel to the pier and click on the cuddle carts. What? Oh, is it one of the rides? Select the mess around interaction. Okay. Well, we can try and bring Kevin later. Right now it's... Alright, it's Saturday, so we won't go to school today. Hmm. Well, okay. Uh, 
Oh, he wants to join an after school activity. What should we have him join? He's socially awkward and romantic. So. Join after school activity. After you do your homework, obviously. Oh, also thrifty is a thing. I'm not feeling it for this family. Anyway, uh, oh, will he join the computer team? He's not a cheerleader because he's socially awkward. He might be a chess team member. Yeah, you know what? I'm I'm gonna have him. Do that. <laughs> Just because I want to see what it's like. And all right, okay. Uh, do homework five times, okay. Can you do it again? No. <laughs> so it, that takes five days at least, uh, Monday to fri Friday, to do. Because you need new homework in between. Okay. Oh, he likes fitness? Okay, yeah, sure. I always click yes on those, even if it's very inconvenient. Uh, sometimes I will go in after and change it if it's too inconvenient, but mostly not. Uh, and I had a mod that automatically said yes but it stopped working because what it did was like it, it asked for every townie and uh, then EA said well let's not have the townies get likes and dislikes because it's what's annoying instead of just giving them get likes and dislikes and I didn't like that they I disliked that they did that <laughs> All right, okay. Oh my god, she was able to hack the Lothario Trust Fund. So let's... Oh, wait. Oh my goodness, not, not this. Let's have her open a bank account and put 133 in there. Uh, I hate that they give, get 20 to begin with because then I need to do math and I really can't be bothered. And let's do like this actually let's do that for every teen oh maybe she she can have those 20 simoleons because i'm gonna give everyone else 20 now because i'm lazy it's easier to give her 20 than to <laughs> than to take it out of all the other kids accounts uh no Career direct deposit 100 for teens. And also, you, especially you, get an account. No. Oh, what am I clicking? Uh, like this. Can kids have an account? I don't think they can. Oh, they can. They don't earn any money, but sometimes they find stuff and s stuff, <laughs> things. I always keep accounts for everyone that is eventually going to move out. And if it's a like, teen, they're dependent on their parents, so they're not paying anything to the household funds. Uh, sometimes if I suspect that a grown-up wants to move out, I have them open accounts as well. <laughs> but in this day, instance, I don't think I will because they seem, well, really in love, but um, the friendship bar is low for some reason. I don't know. Um, no. 
No, see, no. We're gonna deactivate the social bunny for these people because I, uh, no. <laughs> I can't have them have social bunnies. You deactivate, please. Also, uh, I heard a lot about, like, the first update that they did, they didn't limit um, romantic uh, interaction on the social bunny, so you could have, like, teens having romantics with, like, their parents and stuff, and then they fixed the social bunny interaction, but people said it didn't work but i think it did um because the damage was already done and they didn't fix the damage that's the issue um today your follower count changed changed by 40 but did it increase or decrease it doesn't say um, all right, okay. Uh, let's do a flirty message. Here you go. Okay. She still wants to buy an object worth 500. What could it be? What should we buy for 500? Like, does she need a better bed? <gasps> or a better computer? He might need a better computer. I mean, this one is good and all, but not, well, it's actually <laughs> kind of the best one. Uh, but this is fun ten, so we could we could get her this one. Instead, it has the cool keyboard. And we can lock. No, always do that wrong. Lock that for everyone but Savannah because it's her computer. Gosh darn it. We're gonna eat. No. Oh, going cooking, apparently. Sure. Aww, nibs. Yachaboo. But uh, I have run out of time, and but I thought it was really fun to figure out these sims are actually uh, uh, not straight. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's about it, I guess. And what happened? Did something happen? Well, well they're both interested in, in uh, this poor dude. <laughs> But he is straight, <laughs> so he's only open for one of them. So yeah, um, oh my goodness, he has arm hair. Okay, so I'm going to end the stream and I want you all to take care and like stay safe, even though like some say COVID is over, it's not. Um, and like also stay safe don't do anything stupid and uh you know stay safe in general take your meds get 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 sleep when you need it eat well you know not your mom but okay <laughs> i'm gonna go now and you all take care okay bye